So in this video, I'll show you guys how to upgrade your VFO dashcam firmware. Generally with dashcam, you don't need to do anything, it's just plug and play. But sometimes product manufacturer will release firmware updates to improve stability and add more features to the dashcam. So this here is VFO A129 Pro Duo, and at the moment it's running uh, version 1.4. And we're going to upgrade to the latest version available. But first make sure that you've inserted a at least 16 gig micro SD card to the dashcam and format it. And to check what firmware version of your dashcam is, we're just going to plug in the USB cable to the dashcam, to the GPS unit, and it should load up. If you insert into this USB port, it's going to be detected as a um, internal storage, so make sure you plug into the GPS unit. And to check the firmware version, just go to... Now I need to stop the recording first before you can go into the menu. So just press record and then go all the way down to firmware version. And now you can see it's 1.4. The latest available is version 2.1 and we're going to upgrade that. But before we do that, let's format the memory card. So go to format and then press OK. And now everything is formatted. Now what we're going to do is we're going to disconnect the cable from the power and we're going to reconnect to the USB port. And then it should say that it's, dis it's connected as a storage device. So on a computer go to um, your browser and type in VFO A129 Pro Duo Firmware and it's the first link. And as you can see, the latest version is version 2.1 and we're going to just download that. And here's some of the changes with the latest update. Now it's about 28 megabytes and once it's finished downloading, we're going to copy this file straight into the main um, file of the dashcam. So once it's finished downloading, just copy and paste it to your internal storage. And now this is the really simple part. All we're going to do is disconnect the dashcam and reconnect it. And once all the lights are gone, reconnect the dashcam and then it should flash. Now that means the dashcam is upgrading to the latest firmware. You shouldn't have any problems um, upgrading it uh, because it's just a really simple process. Um, but if you run into any troubles, just redo the procedure or just contact the supplier. Maybe you might have a faulty dash cam. And now just to make sure everything is done, just go back to your USB drive and you'll see that the file is gone. Anyway, let's confirm that it's version 2.1. So we're going to disconnect this from here and reconnect to the power cable and then we're going to stop the recording first and then go to the menu go all the way down to the firmware version and now we can see it's version 2.1 that's it for this video thanks for watching if you have any questions let me know in the comments anyway hope you all have a great day stay safe and peace